Hi, I'm David Hill with New York Habitat. Today we're going to discover one of my favorite cities in the south of France, Montpellier. Most people think of the south of France as a summer destination, but today we're going to see that the region, and Montpellier in particular, is a thriving and exciting place to visit, even in the cooler months. Montpellier is the eighth largest city of the country. It's been the fastest growing city in France over the past 25 years, and is the third largest French city on the Mediterranean coast, just after Marseille and Nice. Our first stop in this video tour is what many consider to be the heart of the city. This is the Place de la Comédie. Dating back to at least 1755, the square today is surrounded by cafes, restaurants, a movie theater, and an opera house. During the winter, make sure to visit the Christmas market which is held here every year. Just off the Place de la Comédie is the Fabre Museum. In 1825, the renowned painter François Xavier Fabre, who found his beginnings in Montpellier, offered a large donation of his works to the city. Today, the museum is classified as a Museum of France by the French Ministry of Culture. Undoubtedly, one of the best parts about Montpellier is its shopping. The city offers everything from global shopping brands to artisan boutiques. Just off the Place de la Comédie, you'll find the Polygon. This shopping center is home to some of the biggest brands, including Zara, H&M, and Gallery Lafayette. The best way to experience the beautiful and vibrant city of Montpellier is to live like a local by renting a furnished apartment or vacation rental during your stay. New York Habitat offers furnished accommodations throughout the city. If boutique shopping is more your style, you'll fall in love with the historical center of Montpellier called the Ecusson. This neighborhood, with its beautiful French-style architecture, is packed with fantastic boutiques, cafes, and restaurants. I'm a big fan of narrow, winding French streets, and the Ecusson has this in spades. Another major shopping destination in Montpellier is the Odysseum. This massive complex located southwest of the center of Montpellier offers big brands such as Ikea, Zara, H&M, and Apple. You'll also find plenty of entertainment with restaurants, bars, a bowling alley, a rock climbing facility, and more. One of the most evident signs of Montpellier's growth in recent years is the new City Hall building. This contemporary glass behemoth with its 107 million euro price tag was designed by Jean Nouvel and was opened in November 2011. Its main hall and surrounding grounds are open to the public. On 
the other side of the polygon, you'll find the Antigon. This neighborhood is best known for its grand neoclassical architectural design, created by Ricardo Bofil. Along with the arch-shaped Hotel de la Région, this one-kilometer visual axis is nicknamed the Champs-Élysées of Montpellier. Getting around to all these great locations is extremely easy, thanks to the state-of-the-art tramway system in Montpellier. As of 2012, there are four lines with more to come. The lines offer access to all parts of the city, including all the attractions mentioned in this video. Well, that's a wrap of our video tour of Montpellier. And of course, there's plenty more to see here. If you know of any hot spots in the city, make sure you leave a comment in the comment section below. And if you're coming to Montpellier, be sure to visit our website at nyhabitat.com and book a vacation rental or furnished apartment with New York Habitat. Live like a local and experience Montpellier like a true Montpellierin. While you're online, head over to our blog. You'll find more useful information on this great city. You can start with our blog article, 48 Hours in Montpellier. I'm David Hill with New York Habitat. Thanks for watching our video tour of Montpellier, and we hope to see you soon in the south of France.